name is Andrew Parker, I'm a general partner at Spark Capital. We are an early stage venture capital firm and we focus at the intersection of media and technology. If I would give people any kind of like caution or guidance, uh, you know, around what, what to avoid when either, you know, pitching a VC or really more importantly around forming a company, it's thinking strongly about your motivations for doing so and being really intellectually honest about that. If you find that you're just really enamored with, you know, these dot-com billionaires emerging in, you know, every new IPO, like, uh, that's, that's really the wrong reason to start a company. I think that, um, they should have a good handle on what the product is going to look like. Uh, it doesn't mean you have to have something completely fully fleshed out, but if, if uh, an investor can't, has to strictly use their imagination and can't touch and feel anything, then um, it's, it's kind of a tough conversation because particularly at Spark, um, at the seed stage, so the earliest possible stage that we can invest in, we're, we're looking for two things. One is a great team. The second thing is being able to you know, take the team and treat them to a certain degree like a black box and just see what product comes out of that black box and say, all right, is this product great? And if so, what does that mean about the team that produced it? To have that second data point where you can see you know, some initial struggles around you know, product decisions, what they decide to prioritize, how simple it is or not, how clean the UI is or not, like that's, that's really informative to us uh, as, as venture investors. And um, so that's something that, that we hope people have answered to a reasonable degree up front. Starting a company is still like just incredibly difficult. And you have to have an irrational passion for the technology that you're working on in order to um, push through that, that difficult initial period. Think long about your um, motivations for why you're starting a company. And if it's anything other than, you know, just like, I just have to do this because I want this thing to exist in the world, then um, you might want to consider doing something else.